What do you do when a black athlete gets arrested? Give his Jewish agent some free press. Let me ask you a bit of news here. Uh, he's scheduled to go for a treatment to the Giants tomorrow. Will he be there? Oh, yes. Yes. I talked to him about that today. Um, he's looking forward to seeing the Giants. The Giants, as an organization, have been remarkably faithful and loyal to Plex throughout his career there. Um, I am a big fan of the Giants organization, and I appreciate their owners, Mr. Tish, Mr. Mara, Jerry Reese, the general manager. They, have, they really care about Plex a lot. Let me get to that, because there's some questions that fans would have. Okay. The first one, as long as we're going to talk about the Giants, is why do you believe that he'll ever play for the Giants again? Most people do not. I, I have to believe I'm an optimist. You know, when you're an agent for your clients, it's very important that you're positive, that you're supportive, that you believe that things are going to work out. Hey, I'm really, I, I, I really care about my client. I'm very concerned about this situation. Um, but I've got to be positive. I've got to support him. And I've got to believe in the system, in the NFL, the legal system, in Plex, and that this is going to work out. Another fan's question. What was he doing with a gun in a nightclub two nights before a game that he wasn't going to play in because of injury? What was he doing with a gun? You know, Tony, that's not something that I can really talk about because we're in the middle of a legal proceeding. Um, you know, privately, I'd be happy to discuss that with you. But publicly, out of respect to my client's legal situation, I can't. Let me ask you this. Oh, uh, contracts, cares there's so a behavior much. clause in all the NFL contracts. Uh, have the Giants contacted you about any contract stipulations that may have been violated with what's gone on so far? You know, I visited with the Giants before the game, uh, before the Redskins game yesterday. And I'm, I'm very touched by the way the Giants have handled this. We've not talked about the contract. They've not talked about him playing. They're concerned about his health, his well-being, his welfare as a human being. Credit the Giants organization tremendously. In all my conversations, their last concern is about football. It's about Plex the person. We're happy that he's healthy, but you have a lot of clients. Have you ever had to talk to them about guns before, and are you going to start now with all those clients? You know, again, this is not an opportunity for me to give a commentary about guns and NFL players. It's just not appropriate in light of what's going on. But it can't on. be a good thing. It can't be. Because of the position that I'm in right now, Tony, I'm just not going to get into that topic. we got to go. Second half about to start, Drew. Thank you for joining us. Good we appreciate you it. Guys. Second half coming up here from Houston with the Texans leading the Jaguars by the score of 10 to nothing. If he really cared about Plaxico Burris, he would have called on the legislature to change the law so people don't automatically get three and a half years in jail just for carrying a weapon.